Hey guys, so um, this is the second video in mine and the Zombie Denise's Halloween movie review series and I'm going to be reviewing Rob Zombie's Halloween 2 today and um, I'm pretty much reduced to filming in my bathroom because we have two tornado warnings today and it's dark and gloomy outside and it's raining like crazy so this is the best lighting I could find. Okay, so pretty much uh, Halloween 2. Things that I liked and things that I didn't like. Um, I liked that they kept Angel Myers the same girl. At least I think it's the same girl. If not, then it looks a lot like her. I like that Sherry Moon Zombie is still in it. That's exciting. Even though her character was a little awkward. But, um, I didn't like how they made my the kid who played Michael Myers a completely different kid that didn't even look like the first kid. And I felt like the first Halloween movie was very, like, it had a lot of layers to it. Um, like, it, was, it wasn't only a movie. Like, that was an actual film to me. I feel like Halloween 2 is just a movie. It's very, um, very flat, very one-dimensional. And um, it was, I felt like it was lacking. Even if I can't put a finger on it, it was lacking in something. And um, I do like Lori's story, and, like, that's cool and her friends were hot and all that good stuff, but, um, other than that, I wasn't entirely impressed. I definitely like the first one a lot better. Like I said, it's very, this film seems very flat to me. Can you hear that rain? Ugh, I have to drive to work in that rain. By the way, if you, if you didn't know, I work at GameStop. And this is my kick-ass name tag. Yeah. Anyway, um, not a, not a great movie, to be completely honest. Um, and I love Rob Zombie movies. It's a good movie. It's not a great movie. It's a, it's a good slash okay movie. Um, Mike, Mike Myers is cool in this movie. Um, it's definitely a lot more jumpy than the first one, but it's still not scary, at least I think. Um, uh, a little bit confusing in parts, it, a little bit annoying, like every 10 minutes watching that movie I just got completely annoyed by something and so it was not entirely enjoyable for me. I don't really have much to say about this one actually, um, I'd probably give this movie like a 5 out of 10. Um, yeah. So that's my review for Halloween 2. Very dry and short, probably, but, uh, you know, there's really not much to say about this movie, to be completely honest. Like, check it out yourself, and, um, let me know what you think in comments down below. Um, yeah, what you like about it, what you don't like about it, if you think it's the best movie ever, or if you think it's the worst movie ever, tell me why. And I will see you guys next week with our next Halloween uh, movie review. And I can't remember off the top of my head what it is right now, but I'll post it in the bottom. And if you guys have any specific questions you want me to answer about that movie, um, then go ahead and put them below and I'll make sure that I answer those questions when I review the next movie. And I will see you guys later.